Hey everyone, welcome home. Today we are in a Red Row Marlowe. We are on the development of Ash Holt, which is part of the Newton Garden Village, around eight miles out of Nottingham city centre. So let's have a look around. Welcome to the living space. Something that Red Row do so incredibly well is proportion their rooms. You've probably noticed the ceiling on this room is so incredibly high. So Red Row as a whole, if you don't know about them as a developer, they've been around since 1974. Something they really focus on is having characterful properties. And part of that is having the skirting boards slightly higher, making sure the ceilings are super high. Their windows you'll always notice are just so incredibly impressive. And this property, it doesn't have a bay or anything like that. However, the windows are still so impressive and a real feature of the room. So this is the lounge. So as you can see, a really great size room. I will of course link everything down below so you can have a look at the floor plan, the dimensions and everything, of all of the rooms. But let's head through to the kitchen, dining and another living space. So this particular Marlowe has had a few upgrades, additions that I will obviously talk you through, but this is the kitchen dining area. I just think this is fabulous. It really does feel like a very welcoming room. So of course we have all the integrated appliances. There's a lot of amazing storage solutions in this kitchen too. And then of course we have the fridge freezer here. I don't know if you've noticed as I kind of walked through the kitchen, but there is so much storage in here. So you've got pan and drawers, then within the drawers we have the cutlery drawer. I love a good pan drawer, I don't know about you. I just think it's the most efficient way to store your pans. But yeah, so much space. And like I said, the pull out storage solutions as well. So in this current setup, they've got the dining table in the middle of the room, which I think is a really, really nice touch because on this particular Marlowe, there is a conservatory added. Let me show you. Look at this. It's crazy how much space this adds on. So like I said, this is an optional extra. It's something that you can add on at the time of purchase. And I definitely think it's a lovely touch, but you don't need it. This, the house itself is so incredibly spacious, but if you know as a family, you tend to like that extra living space, maybe a playroom or something like that, it definitely is a brilliant addition. Being a four bedroom family home, of course there is a utility space and this one is a great size. We also have access out to the garden and of course a cloakroom. But yeah, this is a really, really great space. In all of kind of Red Rose houses as a whole, the storage solutions are brilliant. There's so much storage around this. Under the stairs you could do so much with this. And that is downstairs. Now upstairs is just as impressive, if not more. So like I said, Red Row love to keep their properties very characterful and that is really well demonstrated upstairs. So let's take a look. Let me show you bedroom four first. So this is currently set up as a home office because let's be honest, so many of us are working from home at the moment. And something that Red Row have recently introduced is the add-on of a built-in home office space. So this is an optional extra that you can upgrade at your time of purchase. I think this is a really nice idea, especially in this nook here. I mean, alternatively, you could have built-in wardrobes, but if you knew you were going to use this space as an office, it's a really awesome thing to do. So yeah, this is bedroom four. So like I said, I mean obviously four bedrooms, this is the fourth one. They're all incredible sizes and what you will notice is the ceilings in each room are either slanted or there's just a little bit to them to add that character. I'm telling you, it makes the rooms feel so much kind of warmer, but because the ceilings in general anyway as a whole red row, their ceilings are very high, you don't feel like you're losing any space, it doesn't feel cramped, it really just adds that lovely touch and warmth of homeliness. So in this particular room, there is built-in wardrobes, which I, I love in a bedroom. So this is technically bedroom number two, a brilliant size and a lovely bright airy room. So back onto the landing. As you can see, it's quite a fun house. It's not, kind of, it's not boxy, it's not what you would expect of a, a new build. There's so much character to this property. So we have the primary bedroom this way, which is just gorgeous, and I'm going to make you wait. Let's go into here, which is bedroom number three. 
look at this room. Not only has this been decorated adorably, I mean Red Row as a whole, so with their show homes, if you ever go and have a look, or maybe you have been, they're very on it with trends, but they also kind of mixed with that classic heritage style that they are just so known for. So coming up kind of in the home space with regards to trends, there's a lot of kind of earthy tones. Everything's a lot warmer. We're seeing less gray and a lot kind of softer tones, softer patterns as you can see demonstrated in this room. I think this is a beautiful room. There's almost that kind of cottagey feel because of the gorgeous windows, yet yeah, you've got the really incredibly high ceiling. I would love this to be my bedroom, actually. I think this is a really lovely one. And then down at this end of the corridor, we have the family bathroom. So this is a really lovely sized room. We've got the bath, shower, the tiles, are lovely actually a thing with red row so on my red row you can pick your optional extras the tile selection is just incredible we actually spoke to uh, their head designer recently and not only does she kind of design the interiors of the show homes her and her team have a massive say when it comes to picking the extras that you get to pick if you're purchasing a red row home so it's almost you don't have like an interior designer but it's as though the things you choose from interior designers have pulled, so they're being pulled from the best places, knowing kind of the upcoming trends, you are really getting a curated selection, which I guess makes it a lot easier. So this, yes, is the family bathroom. And then we move on to the primary suite. We're going to call it a suite because it definitely feels like that. Into the ensuite, this is a really lovely space within the primary bedroom. We obviously have the toilet sink, and then we have a lovely shower in the corner. Just a really nice kind of space to get ready out of the way, really calm space. It's, there's very calm energy in here. And then we come through to the primary bedroom, which is just, gorgeous. I really love this. I love the feel that the ceiling gives in here. The wall of wardrobes, oh my goodness, the absolute dream. It's just such a charming room. I definitely think that's the best way to describe it. Just the little the, the features of the ceiling, it really is that characterful feel that Red Row wanted to go for. I think they've absolutely hit the nail on the head with this room. It is stunning. And definitely for the house itself, like I said, this is the Marlowe. I think this room definitely lives up to it being that four bedroom detached property. It also has an internal garage. It is a stunning home. And I will of course link all of the info down below. Like I said, we are on Ash Holt, so we are about eight miles away from Nottingham city center. But of course, if you love this style of property, Red Row have them up and down the country. So I will link to the page so you can have a little nosy. But yeah, we've toured a couple of other Red Row homes. So make sure you subscribe so you see those or go and have a little look at our other videos and I will see you next time. Bye.